how disappointed are you? I mean, obviously. This, you know, uh, yeah, I, I, I'm uh, certainly I'm disappointed. I played. Uh, I felt like I played a lot better than I'm scoring, and um, certainly uh, didn't finish this round very well. But um, I, I'll tell you, I, I think it's. Uh, I'm. I'm really happy that I had this uh, chance, this opportunity this week. It's. Um, I've got to give it really handed to the USGA for doing just an incredible setup. It's just the best I've ever seen, and um, it's it's identifying the the best players. It's making the players a story. I think the biggest thing was uh, you know pin placements instead of putting them right on the edges, they were in, in good spots, uh, rewarding great shots. I just couldn't. I can't say enough great things about how this week has gone so far, and um, I'm appreciative to the effort they've put in. And uh, for the opportunity that I had this week, uh, I'll come out tomorrow and play as play as well as I can. But um, it was uh, today was the day I needed to go low. I played well enough to do it. I had many opportunities. Didn't putt well. Uh, didn't get them to go in. I left them short the whole time. But um, uh, and then I, you know, finished poorly. But uh, for the most part, I've really enjoyed this week. I've had a lot of fun testing my game, testing myself mentally, my physical game, and uh, it's been a, a fun challenge. Phil, they said that it was going to be pretty much the same setup as the last time, 2000. Uh, 10. 10, 10. Yes, sorry. Uh, do, do you feel that is pretty much the same, or in because I mean you're obviously praising them now in this case. Well, I mean, I just I just think that uh, you've you've got to give credit when when they do a good job like this. They've done a great job, and. Um, you know, last there there have been many times where you know one or two yards difference in in hole location would have made a world of difference in the condi you know given the conditions being so tough and stuff. And uh, this week they've done a good job in uh, in doing that. Phil, on um, a couple holes like one, you, it looked like you and Tim were sort of talking about maybe going with the driver for the gallery was trying to egg you on to go <laughs> the um, go for it. 18. It was a pretty bold. So 18, I couldn't get, I couldn't get there. I just made bogey on 17, and um, if I hit a good drive, uh, I'd be able to reach it. And really, it was a test for me. I've been working on my driver. I've, I've actually driven the ball pretty well this week. I've had a nice turn of events uh, with the driver. I've hit, I'm hitting the ball a lot straighter, and it was really a good test for me on that last drive there. And uh, I'm not quite, I'm not quite there. I didn't pass uh, that last test. <laughs> No, but I knew his caddy, Andy Martinez, really well, and uh, I really think the world of him. And uh, for him to, to be on his bag, I knew he has to be a good guy. How do you see the conditions setting up for tomorrow? Um, I don't know. I, I don't know how it's going to be. But uh, I'm looking forward to the challenge. The first three days, uh, they've uh, really done a great job in letting the, the, the players sh kind of showcase their talents. Well, the green's just tightening up a little bit now. and. Certainly, but but that's not the issue because as long as the hole locations are, are in a safe in a, in a good area, that it's uh, it's not uh, it's not so much the, the conditions as much as it is the hole locations oftentimes, and it's been really well done. Graham said yesterday that watch, playing those two days with you was inspiring to him to see that you have as much fire and passion as you ever have. Um, what does that mean to you that? A guy on the cusp of 40 is looking at you that way. And well, I think that um, we we uh, we as players need to look back, kind of on on the on our career and on our life, with a lot of gratitude for the fact that we get to do you know do this for a living. And when I'm here at Pebble Beach, there's there's uh, no place that I am more grateful for the uh, the life that I've been able to lead and my career and my family and so forth and especially going back with my grandfather being here and and what this place here at Pebble Beach has meant to me over the years and having so many great moments here that uh, I can't help but you know walk this this golf course and and feel grateful for uh, you know all the things all, all the great things in my life and uh, this is a very spiritual place for me Yeah, the people here has been terrific. They've really been, really been sweet. Thanks a lot. Thank Thanks, Phil. Okay, Appreciate thank it. you.